Hey, what's up guys? This is Zeus5635 here, back with another video. This is in Titanfall 2, and this is about the new DLC that just came out on February 23rd. Now, this, DM, though, this DLC introduced a lot of new things, including the new game mode known as Live Fire. It's really fun. It's a 5v5 or 6v6 game mode, no respawns, one life, and it's 60 seconds long. No titans, it's only pilot v pilot. It is so fun. And we'll get into a game like that here in just a little bit. But also we have new content, random new content, new maps for live fire, two new maps, meadow and stacks. There's also two new executions, late hit and in your face. There's a few new features as you can see here, just, just some random things, some balance changes, some improvements overall, and some random bug fixes. But of course the biggest part of this is, well of course there are late hit, pulling your enemy at lightning speed. Now this is custom to stim, but you don't have to be using stim. And the way you unlock this is by you get 10 execution using inner pieces. But to get inner pieces, you have to do 50 executions. And now the other new execution is in your face. Takedown followed by a data knife to the face, which sounds like a lot of fun. But that one you just have to unlock either by spending credits or by getting it as an advocate gift. Now, let's get into a game of Live Fire. Alright, so we're going into a game of Live Fire. As you can see, we're on stacks here. Now, this is a complex looking thing. A lot of industrial things. Oh, wait. That's the wrong button. Okay. So, as you can see there, there's a 60 second timer. Kill all enemy pilots or control the flag to win. Now, it's very fast paced kind of difficult and if you die it's kind of annoying because you don't get to respawn or anything like that I just kind of jumped into their base without seeing any of them which is weird usually you're facing some pretty high level players that that will kill you pretty pretty quickly I'm this is actually quite odd that I'm not seeing anybody oh here's somebody come here bud I almost got him whoa let's not die just yet Am I the... I am the only person. Oh, I'm the last person alive. Let's get one kill. Nope. Nice. I'm still not very good at it. I've only played it a couple times, but that was 3v1. That wasn't very efficient for me to do there. But it's based on five rounds. Whoever wins the most rounds within five. Just like um, LTS, it goes to three rounds. This goes to five rounds. Oh, I keep, I'm too late to change that. But this is just one of the two maps. This is Stacks. I actually like Stacks, but Meadows is what I really like. Ooh, there we go. Okay, so I killed the dude with the flag so that their chances of winning that way are not in order anymore. You Just... You got oh yeah okay so I guess that was some hardcore lag for me. I actually want to see how he killed me. Oh okay so I thought I was lagging though no, he just jumped down on me. All right so I have not been doing very well. I got a kill but this is very very fast paced. I would recommend using things like stim or phase shift things to give you that extra edge to get that speed that you need because it is 60 seconds long no longer than that. Unlike bounty hunt it's like 15 minutes. This is only 60 seconds, so you gotta move fast and you gotta move with purpose. You gotta make sure you stay alive. Oh, yeah, see? That was me not staying alive. Of course, I was the first person to die. But that was because I was sitting in a <laughs> sitting in a smoke. So that was so that was pretty awesome. And I'll go ahead and show you guys meadows here. So here we are on meadows. Now this map is a lot different from complex or stacks. Being that was a lot more of a complex type thing, a lot of materialistic things. This one is obviously set in nature. Now the live fire maps are both really small because they're supposed to be small because it's just pilots versus pilots. We don't need room for titans or anything like that. But before I go any farther, let me just say that there is double XP, as you can see down there, for live fire only from now until the 27th, I believe, of this month. So yeah, go ahead and go, go out and play some live fire. It's tons of fun, and you'll get a bunch more XP for it. But yeah, this is Meadows. It's not very different, except you might see that giant, you know, 
what's it called, the zip line going from one side of the map to the other. That you can actually ride and go from one side to the other. It's so much fun, and it actually goes pretty fast, except you're going right down the middle of the map, which is kind of the no man's land, which you don't ever really want to be in. And after, I believe it is three rounds, you switch sides, so... Yeah, because we've won one and they've won two. Oh, see, you can ride this either way, which is kind of cool. Woo! Woo! There goes you and you. Wow, that was actually a really, really good round for me. See, the rounds can actually go really quick like that. That was, I don't even know how long of a time. I think that was only probably less than 30 seconds of that match. Everybody killed everybody really quickly. But yeah, that's the main point of this. It's it's so much fun. You guys should definitely go out and play some of it. But yeah, that's basically the overview of the new DLC for Titanfall. And if I haven't mentioned already that this is all completely free, you do not have to spend any money to get this DLC. It's all free. As long as you have Titanfall 2, you can download it. It's I don't I don't remember how big of a download it was, but yeah, that's pretty much all. So there you go, guys. If you guys like this video and you want more like it, keep it tuned here, and I will see you all in the next one.